In episode 5 of The Boys, we see that Homelander has detected that there is a leak somewhere in Vought. Whether this is by Sister Sage or his own detection, we are not clear yet. But Cameron Coleman, Vought's loud talking mouthpiece and personification of real world right wing media talking heads, was brought in having seemingly been set up by Ashley after he broke up with her. He is essentially offered up to the fanatics in the room. Homelander gives a speech, essentially his uniting call, that from this moment on, the soups will be merciful gods, not celebrities begging for attention. Then they beat Coleman off screen with some honestly sickening sound effects. So what's the meaning of this scene? I think it symbolizes a lot of things. Homelander is doing another test, like when he had the deep A-Train and Black Noir beat the Homelander fans from a few episodes back. This is a test to see who is willing to take a non soups life and completely obey his orders, almost like a cult or an Illuminati. We see in this scene that Firecracker is the first one up, almost excited to prove her loyalty to Homelander. Sam and Kate also were pretty quick to jump onto this plan saying, whatever you need Homelander, we're at your disposal. The only person in this room who is not completely down with this plan is A-Train. Now A-Train has been teetering away from the Seven for a bit. Back with the Homelander fans, he really held back and didn't immediately swing into them like Black Noir and The Deep did, but he still completed the plan by planting the bodies at the riot. The only other person on the Seven that decided that they had enough that wasn't Starlight is Queen Mae, and she has super invulnerability, unlike A-Train. He is the only one on the Seven left with any hint of compassion for non suit and he made up with Huey and is attempting to reconnect with his family. If the writing is on the wall, I'd say that the show is having him set up for a heroic redemption sacrifice, but by which way? I don't know. Additionally, Cameron Coleman had sent out a message on social media, dictating that if we are seeing his message, then he is dead, and something awful is going on at Vought. A basic middle finger from the grave. But what do you think about this scene and Coleman's death? Let us know in the comments down below.